Hey YouTube, it's your boy Desak, and today we're in Bristol here to check out the Clifton Observatory next to the Clifton Suspension Bridge. Local folklore suggests that there were two giants that lived here some hundreds of years ago. So come with me, let's check this out. Clifton Observatory is open from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. Don't forget. So coming to the reception, it's five pounds for adults, three pounds for kids, which includes the observatory and going to see the giant cave. It's gonna be fun. Let's do this. We're ready for the tour. There are two places to explore, the observatory and the giant cave. Which one first? Let's go. In the camera obscura, you can see a 360 live time footages from the suspension bridge. It's a bit dark because obviously it needs more light. It's something to look out for when you get to the observatory. Really, really cool. Can you see that? Nice. Information that describes the phenomenon in the dark room. If you've done science and physics back in school, you should know how light and reflection works. So the key invention that led to the development of the photography are all here. You can read that for yourself. Nothing much to see, but it's quite a stunning view here. Here you can see the bridge. And there's a cute little stool to sit on and take a nice view. Should be fun. Now let's go down to the Giant's Cave. Let's see what that place has to offer. Chapel in 305 AD. Let's check this out. You need to watch your head. About to embark on the 130 steps down into the Giant's Cave. But before that, Safety test. So history tells us that the stairs was one part of the chapel in 305 AD. During the 17th century, it was revealed that a man lived here in this cave for religious solitude. Wow. Anyway, strange. The tunnel leading down to the cave is about 200 feet long or 61 meters and opens up to a cliff face with a beautiful view over the Avon Gorge. Can't wait to see this. Wow, it's quite narrow and you need to watch your head, hence why the hard hat. If you're claustrophobic, it's not too bad, it's doable. Yeah, so we're going down to the giant's cave. I can't wait to see the view at the end of this tunnel. This is quite steep and I need to duck. Let me turn the camera so you see what I'm filming. Look at that. Oh, oh. yeah. Oh. There you go. So we're here now. Oh, look at that against my foot. Footsteps. Wow. Let's see. The moment we've all been waiting for. The giant cave. A little bit of an anticlimax.
was hoping to find a bit more open space but as you can see it's quite guarded for obvious reasons so the question i asked myself getting to the apex of this tour if giants really lived here where did they live because look at that look at this hole cave i can live here comfortably i don't know what dimension the giant is to live in such a small hole but it makes no sense to me does it to you So we've come to the end of yet another beautiful tour from Bristol. This is from me, travel with Baysack. I'm out. Peace.